Hey everybody, this is John here from Crypto Bay and welcome to today's market review video from May 18th, 2018. So guys, consensus is officially over and the market prices have failed to react positively. Throughout consensus for the three days, we were seeing loads of positive headlines, but the prices have failed to run up. Historically speaking, prices normally run on consensus days, but this time it hasn't happened. Yesterday in Bitcoin, we can see in the early chart, we were forming an ascending triangle. Typically an ascending triangle is a positive pattern, normally trades in a tight range and then breaks to the upside. However, yesterday this pattern broke down and price action in Bitcoin managed to close below the significant support level of 8,200. This level has acted as a significant support in the past and is also the 50% Fibonacci retracement between 6,600 and the 10k level in Bitcoin. If we go to the daily chart, we can actually see this better. So, the 8,200 mark is the 50% retracement between this swing low here and this high. The next support level, guys, that I'm seeing is 7,800, which has historically been a point of uh, support but also is the 0.618 retracement level for Fibonacci. Most of the market is down but two coins which are showing good gains on the day are VeChain which has announced its first ICO to launch on its platform. So on this news VeChain has seen a bit of a run up on decent volume. Another coin which has seen a run up is Binance Coin. Binance has came out with the news that it's going to be giving double rewards for referral and as we can see in the chart it's seen a huge run up on this news of 16% on the day but overall in the crypto market nearly every coin is down it's a lot of red the market cap is down to 378 billion the volume is very low around 20 billion and bitcoin dominance is at 37.5% bitcoin holding up better than the rest of the altcoins in news, we have two big influencers mentioning Bitcoin and blockchain. Jack Ma was at a conference over the past few days and he once again repeated, because he said this in the news before, that he feels Bitcoin is a bubble but blockchain isn't. His company, Alibaba, is securing many patents for blockchain, so he obviously anticipates blockchain to have a huge impact on industries going forward in the future. Another big influencer, Steve Wozniak, gave thumbs up to both blockchain and Bitcoin. He sees blockchain leading the next IT rev revolution and he's hugely bullish on what it can do to reshape the industry. Funny enough, he said that he doesn't actually own much cryptocurrencies because he doesn't want to be an investor and constantly watch the prices but he does still hold one Bitcoin and two Ether. He is more uh, optimistic about Ethereum than Bitcoin. So let's see how that plays out going forward. Also, we have JP Morgan announcing on the final day of consensus that it's going to prototype a blockchain platform to reduce its costs and to make securities transactions smoother. JP Morgan, one of the biggest banks in the world prototyping with blockchain they're obviously anticipating blockchain to have huge impact on industries going forward and if they can make cut costs and make transactions smoother obviously this will lead the way forward for other banks to follow behind and we also have Tel Aviv stock exchange experimenting with blockchain this one's a bit different, it's more of a blockchain lending platform where people can lend securities through blockchain. So going forward, it'll be interesting to see how this one develops and if implemented, how it's gonna work and whether it can be applied to other companies that are similar. That's all for today, guys. So just to quickly recap on Bitcoin again, closing below the 8,200 level was a very bearish sign price action is now coming back up to this level so it'll be interesting to see if this support level can turn into resistance and the next support level i am seeing is 7800
So that's it for today, guys. Make sure to tune in tomorrow and make sure to like and subscribe. See you.